back with Minecraft and we're building a platform or I'm building it. I mean you can include yourself in this royal we if you wish we 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 which does not mean PP but if you do not wish to include yourself well that's your that's your opinion and do I respect your opinion in some respects and I think that's only respectful enough in some respects okay love building large wooden platforms it's just so much fun and I'm not even being sarcastic and if you still think I'm being sarcastic I'm telling you that I'm not okay sarcasm is just one of those things that I personally can't stand and of and I have friends that are sarcastic sometimes and those are the moments in which I wish I didn't know them because really I don't like sarcasm. Nine, ten, nine. Oh spotted. Okay, just looking for light deficiencies. Center seems fine. Okay, I believe it might very well be time for me to move the dirt. Move the dirt. Move the dirt. Move the dirt. Dirt, dirt, dirt. Gotta move it all. Gotta move it all to the other place. Where'd it go? I don't know. Where, where did my dirt... Oh, it's on top. Eventually, I might have to expand the lower platform all the way over there, but not today. Not that it's a bad thing. I really am entertained by making large wooden platforms. Does that sound sad? I don't know. Does it? Okay. I have to fill holes in this platform. Boom! Bam! Pow! Swoosh! Now the last one wasn't as cool as the others, but yeah, I guess things happen. And let's get myself a nice bunch to make into another piece of Dirt! Mmm. Love dirt. It's very good. Okay. Now all we have to do is wait. Wait for some nice young succulent well not really I mean how can a tree be succulent some nice young trees to grow and we'll have some nice things to do in the meantime I'm gonna make myself a crook because I can use a crook but I myself I'm not a crook poor Nixon poor old Nixon okay so if I remember correctly. Okay, now I've got an infinite water source. So now what I need is sand so that I can get bone meal and dust. Oops, wrong thing. Get some 
cobble. I could make a spawning platform and get sand in that manner, but you know what? It just doesn't sound very appealing when you can't really make weapons that are very good. Some hoss gravel. Well, we don't want your gravel, we want the sand. The true thing. Now that I think about it, let me just check. Uh, no, wrong but There I go. The, the sand... Oh no. Don't tell me I've been doing it wrong the whole time. Which one gives bone meal? Apparently sand doesn't. It is dust. Oh my goodness, I've been doing it wrong the whole time. I've been doing this whole thing wrong. I'm so ashamed. I am really, I really am. <laughs> yeah, it's so embarrassing when you get things wrong. But, well, I guess you got to live with it. There's nothing in a pattern just. Should there be? No, there shouldn't be. Okay, you, you just got to live with it. Sometimes you do things wrong and there's just nothing you can do about it. What are you supposed to do about it? Nothing. There's nothing you can do about it. Let me put this in the pattern chest. But that is something I can do about that. So, What should I do while I wait? Maybe sing a song? Because I, so far, I haven't really had much of an audience. I don't know if my audience likes the fact that I sing songs. I don't even know if they like it. So if you're listening right now, do you like the songs I sing? If you haven't seen other videos where I do sing songs, then maybe you might want to do that before expressing your opinion. Of course, do I really want to sing when it rains? Mm. Oh my goodness. Yeah. I really don't want water in this bucket. I mean, barrel. Everyone's fine, just not this one. Okay. Trees have no minds. So, I was about to say, you know you want to grow, but then I realized, well, actually you don't want anything, and you don't know anything. So, you know nothing, little tree. You know absolutely know nothing. You know nothing. You want nothing. So do I have respect for the animal rights movement? Um, not much, I'll be honest with you. I really think that sometimes some of these animal rights activists go overboard when they say certain things. I mean, I don't really think that animals should have lawyers because to be honest an animal does not understand the concept of legality in the first place nor does an animal understand the concept of lawyers and an animal can't really pay anybody any money because let's be honest an animal can't accrue money so an animal can't really pay money. Of course, people can, I don't know, will money to their animals, but the animal itself can't carry the money. And even if it could, it really wouldn't. So I really think that animals are literally not really s smart. Animals aren't smart compared to people. People are much smarter than animals. 
And it's true, people are much smarter than animals. I mean, if you compare... a chimpanzee to a person. I mean, chimpanzee, does a chimpanzee have a blog and actively talk about deep, meaningful topics? No, because chimpanzees don't understand deep, meaningful topics. And so, yeah. that that's the problem with animal rights the fact that animals themselves don't really have a desire for rights in the first place I mean if animals asked for rights maybe I'd be more inclined to give them rights but the fact that they probably don't entirely understand the concept of rights really makes me doubt that they could use rights because they really don't have any need for them. So, yeah, that's a huge problem with some things. I want to use my crook. Ha! Huh. On guard, imaginary enemy. I will smite you with my mighty crook. And then I will break your leg. Because I'm mean like that. I'm going to break your leg. Now, of course, vegetarianism. If you're a vegetarian, fine. You, you can do that. But don't treat it as a moral obligation because it's not. Ooh, I don't want to hurt animals. Well, that's fine if you don't want to hurt animals. But is it wrong to hurt animals in order to have food? Now, me being a Christian, of course, I read the Bible and it explicitly says to... Uh, Noah that he can in fact eat animals and meat and also later on in the New Testament it says that abstaining from meats as well as uh, abstaining from marriage is not moral obligation in any sense. Let's put that in there. So, why do people then do this? Some people treat it as something that is true and religious and needs to be done, as in, you are a bad person if you eat animals or you hurt animals in order to gain food. And I'm, I'm just going to say it, animals aren't people. Animals might have personality, but that doesn't make them people. And again, with the controversial sayings, highly controversial uh, things that I say, but uh, see you all next time.